Condor Solvig Gen 2 pack here. This hasn't even got into stores yet. It literally just came in from the manufacturer to salt to Condor to me. And uh, since a lot of you guys have been asking for a uh, review on this and some follow up on it, I thought I would, I would get to this right away and just do a, a really fast review. So in some ways it's similar to the to the Solveig. I mean, for instance, it's got this this back system where you can carry uh, gear, a rifle, that kind of thing. But what's improved is they've done away with the little removable clips that, that snapped apart, uh, which caused me to actually remove this back panel and stop using it for the purpose I was using it for. They've added some side pockets here too, so you can carry water bottles as well and other gear that you want to have uh, close at hand. And uh, let's let's jump into the pack because I haven't even opened this thing up yet. I will pull this off. We have a clip system here too. Um, since I don't have a description, I would say that's for, you know, putting a, a barrel or something through there. You could actually slide a barrel through there quite easily and use it as a carrying system. You have molly on the outside here too. So potentially, without taking this apart, you could flip this around, have Molly on the back, you can have your nameplate, uh, whatever you're using there for ID, or for your unit, your core, whatever. I don't know, just fun stuff. Like, uh, the coloring on this is actually pretty sweet. I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but it's like a mottled brown. And it doesn't look tactical, but at the same time, this would be fantastic for tactical stuff. Uh, but at the same time, it'd also be great for around town because it does not look like a tactical pack. So, but let's let's, uh, let's dive into this thing a little further. Okay, so you have a pocket system here, and you can access it from both sides. So that's that's super unique. I would say you could use like that for a, a tablet or something. You've got your sock pocket here. I usually carry like sunglasses and stuff in there that I don't want getting scratched or phones. You've got your large pocket here like the first version of the Solveig. And then you have your uh, administration pockets in the sides. You can carry phones, you could carry notepads. You've got a key keeper as well too. Highly recommend using those. There's nothing worse than losing your keys halfway through a trip in the middle of nowhere. You have more administrative pockets on this side. Uh, you can carry a assortment of pens and stuff like that, like I do, for writing down data. And then you have the same opening system as you do for the original. And I really like packs that have these full zips. You have your pockets for organizing. You've got this one, you've got a bottom one. Um, I like the fact that they use this bluish gray in the back because when you're looking in this, you have something to provide a bit of reflection, a bit of light, and you can see more easily what's in it. If this was just like a black pit of no nothing, then everything would disappear into there. Uh, you have another like notebook pocket here, and then you have your standard laptop you know, this is a dual purpose pack. You could use this for for um, hiking. You could use this for, uh, you know, school. You could use this as a everyday go bag or something you keep in your vehicle for keeping your emergency gear in it. You've got a drainage hole in the bottom too. So that in case you have, um, in case you have like any water, anything spill in there, it's gonna go straight out the bottom. And then on the front, I really like what Condor has been doing with their backpacks. And that is putting an insulated portion in the back here so that you can actually put your, your bladder, your water bladder in here. And you've got an opening here for, uh, for the spout to go through. So um, this is insulated on either side. It's insulated from your back. It's separated from your back. You've got your nice um, breathable uh, padding 
which is going to, you know, stop you from getting super sweaty in the summer and it's going to stop you from getting cold in the winter because you're going to stay a lot drier. And you've got some air channels here as well too. You've got the uh, same buckles that Condor has been using. However, first impression is that these actually, they lock well, they slide better. So I would say that Condor has changed something here. This is definitely an improvement from my first Condor pack and um, miles ahead of my first Condor chest rig that I had like, I don't know, man, like a decade ago. Uh, yeah, that's, that's really it in a nutshell. Really comfortable padded, you know, thick padding on here. And you've got like a meshy foam type thing that's breathable that allows air to, to, to um, and heat to, to expel off your body and through this. You can, carry, you can carry an amazing amount of gear in these little packs and, you know, not really, not really notice it. Um, the only thing I ever had a problem with on my Condor pack was that I grabbed, what I did is I actually accidentally grabbed the zipper and this was caught and I pulled the zipper apart and that broke the zipper. Other than that, the pack is still in use. It's still my son, my son's uh, emergency bag and it works really well. Um, I'll say it again, I really like this color. Like this is, that's a really sweet looking color. It looks, um, it's very like urbanite. But at the same time, if I was in the woods with this, this I'd have no trouble hiding if I had to. Uh, and it's, it's very low key. I suppose if you wanted to, you could also use this, this pocket here as, a, as sort of a hidden weapon pocket or something like that as well too. Uh, you know, because it's hidden behind this panel, people are not going to notice that as well. It's not going to print, you know, that you have something in your backpack for self-defense. Uh, again, really good job guys. Um, thanks Condor for getting this out to me so quickly and I will do more follow-up. You'll see this in other videos and stuff. Um, great little bag. I mean, that's, that's a sweet little, uh, everyday go bag. Can't really ask for much more than that. Very unique, very functional. And, um, yeah, I, I've really liked, I really like my, my other Condor Solvig as well too. And I really like the improvements. I mean, this water bottle holder right here, super, super handy, uh, just because it's just so accessible and I'm forever like losing water bottles because I don't have something like this. And it's got a tight elastic on here to keep everything intact or in inside rather than falling out. So that should fit like a Nalgene or your typical like old school water bottles for bicycles, that kind of size. And, um, and do really, really well. Yeah, that's about it for now. Have a good night guys. And uh, thanks for joining me.